guys and welcome back to three layers deep today I'm actually going to do a review on some new lip products or lipsticks that Maybelline came out with and they I believe they're called high shine is from the color sensational line and it's just like an extended um, product I guess or a different packaging um, these are more luster finishes so you're gonna get like that lipstick lip gloss combo without actually having to do both steps so the packaging is just like the color sensationals but they have that nice silver packaging very sleek very shiny as you can see I guess it goes with the um, lip product itself which is called high shine and I picked up two the day that I went, the day that I happened to see them, you know, they have 10 shades. They are all luster finishes, so very shiny on the lips. And they are not, um, like the color, you actually have to build it up. It's not like a color that you just do one swoop and it's very opaque and pigmented. So the finish is almost like a MAC luster. So if you have that, you know, if you have lusters, I'm not really a fan of love, love, la, la, la. I'm not really a fan of luster um, um, lipsticks. I own many from MAC, but I I like mattes, satins, you know, even cream sheens. I like amplifieds. I like color on my lips. So I really don't utilize my lusters as much. But when I saw these, I don't know, the packaging was really, really cute and it was new. So I definitely like had to get them so there i got two that day and you can find them at what well i found it at walmart my local walmart they cost 550 just like the other um color sensationals and um they have about 10 shades like i said so ranging from pink all the way to like a darker plums and like mahogany colors which out of all 10 i just found four that i really liked and would wear but that day that I that I saw them, I picked up two only. But I'm definitely going to go back to pick up, I think, this Marvelicious and Pink. I want to say Pink Freeze. I'm not sure because one is really... Like, there's some that I really like. They're frosty and there's some that are just kind of slightly shimmery. Like, the ones that I had that I, that I picked up, they just have a very, very light, light shimmer. Which I know you're definitely not going to be able to pick it up on here. But this is one of the ones that I picked up. And this one is called um, Fruit Punch. I don't think you're going to read that. But as you can see, okay, that's one swipe. And this color is beautiful. I really, really like this color. And they smell, oh, they kind of remind me of like a Kool-Aid, you know, or like Hawaiian Punch. Just very, very subdued, you know. So they don't have like that that um like play-doh-y smell, which I actually don't mind from the original color sensationals, which I don't I really don't mind that scent. But these smell more like mm, more fruity, I would say. So it's nice, but if you don't like scents, then you want to take that into consideration. But this is more like you have to build it up. Like these are colors that are very like kind of easy going. You can just, you know, slap it on really quick. It's not going to overpower your eye look. Um, but it's still not going to, you're still going to look put together. You see what I'm saying? Like sometimes you just, you want some color on your lips. But um, the colors that you have are so pigmented that it, maybe sometimes it takes away from the eye look or from whatever you're trying to achieve. So... I still like I have my eyes you know done up but I still wanted some color I didn't want to go like nude or um, you know barely their lipstick I wanted to have some color but that is still it, it kind of complemented the look so um, this is fruit I'm sorry fruit punch yes it is fruit punch and as you can see you have to kind of build up the color so it takes a few swipes to actually get the true true like pigment from it and then I have the one that I'm actually wearing, mm, oh, such a pretty color. And this one's called Coral Luster. I don't think you're going to see that. And this is what this one looks like. And I'm going to include pictures at the end so you can see the true, true um, color. But that's what they look like. And that's pretty much the finish of all of them. Again, I'm not too of a luster finish kind of person but I was really drawn to these and I'm definitely going to pick up those other two which is the pink and the mauve color I really really like those you can't ever have it you can never have enough pinks in your collection and um mauves I mean they kind of just go with everything 
So that's the one I'm wearing. I really, really like it. The staying power, um, I mean, it is more of a um, luster. Obviously, it is not more of a luster. It's just a, lust a luster lipstick. So the stay, well, let me see. Hmm. I've had it on. I guess you can get a couple, you know, a couple, two, three hours out of them. No, I think that's probably pushing it. You know what? I can't even say, to be honest. I didn't really pay attention to that. But I did notice that even after the color rubbed off, I still was left with a little bit of, like, staining on my lips. So that was nice. I didn't, you know, I didn't just go from having color on my lips to being completely, you know, bare-lipped. So I found that kind of nice. You can always slap out, you know, slap on some lip gloss if you happen to have forgotten the lipstick at home or something. And the texture it's not i don't i want i don't want to say it's completely like smooth like a gloss it has a slight texture to it it's not gritty i don't want to say like gritty but it's not like completely smooth you know what i mean so let's see what else can i say about them so that was the stain power like i said it had 10 colors in the collection and that in the line and again the finish is luster as you can see is very shiny but it looks really really nice like i actually like these like i said i'm gonna pick up some more i figured i would just bring these out to you guys letting you know what i thought about them if you even cared some of you guys may care but yes they're nice and um they go for 550 i saw them at my local walmart and they're right by where the color sensationals are so if you see the color, the regular color sensational lipsticks then you'll see these right under it so look at how cute the packaging is it's very shiny so yeah so this is like i put this on like when i first got them home i'm the type that i need to just try things as soon as i get them so i applied this one on which is the coral one and uh i fell in love with it and um so yes that is about it i just wanted to come really quickly and just bring these out i know i probably made this video longer than it should have been but if you guys didn't know about these now you do and if you guys happen to you know have any if you purchased any if you try them definitely comment down below i want to know what you think but if you're a luster girl um but that still wants some color because maybe a lot of a lot of lust, lusters are more like just gloss than it is color these actually have the color and the luster to go with it and it's like a two-one product without having actually to do the, you know doing the two steps so um yeah that was pretty much it and i will talk to you guys in my next video god bless you bye